Hi guys, welcome back to the channel where I'm very excited to say that we are beginning our FIFA 22 Ultimate Team Road to Glory. I'll post mostly daily just giving you updates of how it goes. Do I care if it gets views or not? Absolutely not, because it probably won't. I was going to do this anyway, so like, who cares? Um, but yeah, we've got so much to do. I'm so excited. Um, we've got early access um, from EA Play. Literally, just go into FIFA 21. It'll be the special offer, a dollar ninety-five. And then once you're done with it, you can just cancel the subscription, so you don't have to play anything. There's the first team of the week. We do so, get a untradeable player here. Um, but yeah, let's do this starting manager, stuff. We're gonna go with Brazil as our starter pack. Um, but yeah, there is an annoying man talking. So let's see who our very first pack of FIFA 22 is gonna be. It's a non-rare Brazilian centre-back. It's going to be Marcao. I think he got a team of the season last year, so he must be half decent. Um, yeah, we take those. Um, obviously, we're probably going to just build a full right. gold squad, and it's then we're going to build our squad, starter squad. So we're going to move it around. I'll do that, and I'll be back. All right, so we've just moved it around a bit. Um, this man is quite so annoying. Let's get the lone player done league. with. This player will most likely just go on the bench. Um, so what you can actually do is you can just go around to all the positions and not have to select anyone. So we get Babu, very ratty player. Um, might choose him at right back. And we'll just go around to all the positions, um, see who we could get, and then I'll decide and I'll be back with that decision. I've only done the first little bit, but I think we're going to choose Allison just as a goalie early on. Brazilian goalie, obviously we did go with Brazil well, as our starter pack. Help. So yeah, Lone players join your we'll club choose for a him. Number of games before they leave. For your first so, few matches, now we're going to choose kits. kits. What you can choose actually do is swap them out with the you bronze one you get in your club and sell them on. So we're going to choose whichever one I reckon will sell the quickest and I reckon that will be PSG um, home kit. And then for the other kit, um probably Barcelona um, and then badge the fans will want to cheer uh, you on, but you need to give them a badge to stand for we'll Choose go with Atletico Madrid we'll, well swap all easy. those and well, sell them on there we go that's the, the starter stuff done and now we've got a bunch of packs I'm gonna open them later but first we're going to do all the starter objectives and I'll be done once I've done all of them all right straight up so I've done most of the basics I just need to change the club name, play a game of squad battles, put on manager contracts, but I can't take it anymore. We're going to open our welcome backpacks for being a returning player. Um, they are tradable, so if I were to get a really good like meta player, that would be sick. So this is our first little like pack opening of the series. Um, and here we have a foot ambassador alone, and I'll take Son as he is the highest rated. And looks a decent card as well. Um, so maybe along the line we might get a normal version of him, um, but not at the minute. Obviously, we are only sitting on 450 coins, which is quite a de decent amount after I only started about five minutes ago. Gold reward pack then. Um, don't expect much from this. Um, it's a player, which is surprising. We get Amiri, untradeable. Um, don't think he would sell for anything even now. Um, and. Ked Ziora. Um, so yeah, we take that, um, and yeah, I'll get on to the good packs. Alright, we're gonna open the stadium, premium stadium pack. We're gonna get the Boca Juniors kits. Um, as I said, I'm gonna be selling on kits, so. We can get rid of the badge, the kit, that sort of stuff. And look, we're making coins already. Um, we can also get rid of all of these TFOs. Um, maybe I should keep maybe the stadium theme and Sheffield United TFO. I did do a career mode on them, so just seems right. And then we've made a thousand coins from that pack. So quick little head start again. Um, I think. I don't even think that's a welcome back thing, like you just get that anyway. Now we've got 480 plus, well it's a gold pack featuring an 80 plus, they're all tradable. I'm probably going to sell literally everybody from these and just make as much money as possible. So yeah, let's open them up. All 
Right, first player then. First good pack. It's not boards. We are going to get um, Fabianski. 82. It's decent. Um, could go for a bit as he is a Prem player. Um, I'll tell you guys about the... Um, what's it called? Uh, thing. The like walkout board animation. So that one. If there's no flares, that is a non-board or workout um i'm just gonna put all those players up to the transfer list um i'll do it again sorry but i'm gonna put all of these guys up to the transfer list and i'll list them up later off camera um once i've opened all the packs so yeah um so i've got three more i just want to see boards boards is what i want and if i were to get a low end meta player um maybe like Marlon or something. I'm, I think he is quite high meta actually. But if I were to get like Marlon, for example, that would be sick. So yeah, I've got a starter team in mind. Um, and we don't get boards again. We get Gonzalo Gedge. Might sell for a bit, I don't know. 86 pace is decent. But as I was saying, I do have a starter squad in mind with, and I know exactly the players I want for that. Um, so I'm just gonna sell pretty much everyone from these get as much money as possible i think it will cost around 30k which is decent um i could sub players out get it a bit um lower um but yeah third one then um yet to get boards or a workout so i haven't been able to show you the new animations we get boards though as you can see with the flares and we get Dries mertens who looks decent um we'll put him up could go for a little something um but yeah, that's good. Boards, if I could get a walkout, a walkout from the last one, that would be good. And we're getting lots of Premier League players, which is obviously really good, as Premier League players are going to sell for a lot more, just because they're in the Premier League, and loads of people will just be like, oh yeah, Prem starter team, that's the way to go. I don't think so, personally. I did that last year, and everyone, for example, you have a 90 pace gold rare striker, gold non rare striker, going to be way more expensive if it's in the prem. We don't get walkouts though, as I'm rambling on, and we get Ante Rabic from AC Milan, 82 rated again. People doing Serie A starter squads, I don't think there will be many. Oh, we get an inform, we get Blast. I think he's a five star skiller or something. Oh no, he's not. But that is decent, an inform from the welcome backpacks that is mad i have pre-ordered um the ultimate edition so we will get a guaranteed um team of the week we'll keep him we'll hold on to blast um but if i were to get him again we can obviously swap it with the duplicate and sell him on so that is the end of our pack like small pack opening um i'm gonna get the rest of the starter objectives done list everyone up and i'll be back with quite a lot of money so that i can buy my starter squad all right, I'll show you this my plan for a starter squad in a second, but we're going to make our first purchase of the Road to Glory in Mbemba, the uh, Congolese centre-back from Porto. Um, we're going to put him in um, right there next to Pepe, and we're also going to try and bring in Wilson Manafa, the Portuguese right-back from Porto, perfect links into Pepe who will probably be him or Anthony will be the most expensive player in the starter squad um so Wilson Manafa going at around a thousand coins he looks like a very good card um so we're obviously going to chuck him into the squad so we've got two out of 11 in um I know that a few of these, Gedson and Grabenberch, are around a thousand coins each. I'm not sure about all the other prices. Marchesin, I might actually be able to afford him at the minute. Um, we want to go search on transfer market. Um, we're on 550. Do you reckon he'd be going up 550? I don't know, but I reckon he would be quite expensive. Yeah, he'll be he'll be a bit more. Um, since he does get those strong links into the likes of Pepe. Um, but yeah, that's the team I want to build. Um, I'm going to get all of the starter objectives done, um, including playing a game of squad battles. I'll show you the first goal so you can see my first goal of the Road to Glory. Um, but then once we've done all that, we'll try and build this team as much as possible. So yeah, let's go. You guys are about to see the first goal of the series. It's a man who, it'll probably be his only goal of the series. But he makes it 1-0 here. It's on beginner squad bells. Who cares? First goal. 
So I've decided on what I'm going to do. I've just gone on Footbin and looked at all the player prices. We have just under 3,000 coins. I've just finished the basics um, objectives group. Um, so I've got some packs. I'm going to do the, um, what's it called? Uh, let's get started um, SBCs after this. But what we can do is we can get get some Fernandez Caduce, I think his name is the guy from Ajax and Graven Birch, who are all under a thousand coins, which is mad to me because they all look like very good cards. So firstly, gonna get that get to Fernandez very quickly, whack him in the team, and then we're gonna get Caduce, I believe it is. Um, obviously we're gonna we are gonna have to chuck position modifiers on all of these guys as. Um, they need chemistry. Um, Caduce is very important for chemistry because obviously he gets those links to Boateng and a Chempong, I think it is. And then Graven Birch, who I saw a couple of days ago on Footbin, was just under 5k. And to, for him to be under 100 coins now, I don't know if he's going to be at that price all the time. But for him to be at that price now already is mad to me. So we're going to take him. Um, so yeah, we've got the entire midfield and half of the defence done. So we've got five out of our 11 players required. Um, I think next I'm going to go for the striker and the left winger. Um, so I'm going to do the starter SBCs. I'm going to open the packs. Um, I've got a crap ton of packs, but most of them are just um, stadium packs, which I, I'm not going to show you guys. So I'm going to list up all the stuff that we got, and I'll be back with more coins to try and finish off this starter team for the end of the video. Also, this is the first SVC of the series, Landmark. So we are submitting the third step here. Some of the players were in my like starter squad, not like the team I'm building, but the one I just got gifted with. So we've got Let's Get Started completed. I'm not going to show you the bronze packs since they're bronze packs. Like, who really wants to see bronze packs? So we're going to open the two players pack, see what we can get, and then I'm pretty much just going to grind pretty much just sell players play games that sort of thing so let's open it up here it is untradeable but let's just give give us a board give us one of the players we need we need come on then it's a silver we get a uh, that will be Gergich and there is a gold non rare behind it and that is a mandragora Nice. Okay. I'm going to list everything up. Um, but I think that may be the end of the video. So I'm going to show you guys the team that well, what we've done so far. We've got 221 coins at the minute. So we've got like nothing. Um, so we're going to have to try and get everything to sell. So we've got the whole midfield complete and the centre back and right back done. Once we get all those players, um, we'll be able to build the team. And that is when we'll hop into the likes of division rivals and then eventually, hopefully, foot champs. So yeah, thank you very much for watching the first episode of the FIFA 22 Road to Glory. Um, yeah, I've got the hiccups now. Um, but yeah, cheers for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.